Hello guys, uh, welcome to my channel. Uh, in this video, I'm gonna show you guys how to build up a simple calculator using the R Studio. This is a basic and easiest way to make a calculator with few line of R cores. If you want to code a Python calculator, you can watch my another tutorial uh, on how to build up a calculator using simple Python course in the link given below. But for now, let's start our out coding for our calculator. Uh, we start with these um, printing statements uh, for different choice of the operations like addition, subtraction, um, ADC. Um, now let's um, write a line of code for input statement uh, which takes um, choices uh, of operations from external users like um, you or me and this should be an integer a number is given in our choices above so uh, I'll take that as an integer and read line and prompt and my prompt statement this time will be enter your choice okay um, also let's take um, uh, user prompt input for two numbers to carry out a uh, different operation and number one okay um we take this number as a real numbers and which are stored in double precision format uh, so that we can easily work with uh, decimal numbers as well as integers so i'll take them as double And then the rest of the code is um, similar to the previous line so but in this case my prompt will be enter your um, first number all right um, for second number uh, I'll just copy that line and paste in here so it will be just similar to the number one second number okay now we write our result um, my result now in this case, um, uh, I'm using a switch function. Um, uh, this function is used to evaluate some um, expression and then uh, to choose one of the further arguments um, according to the um, uh, choices made. Um, this function has a much shorter code and is generally faster than if statements. So I usually just go with uh, switch function if I have to deal with three or more function. So now I write my choice and then write my arguments. My first argument is addition of number. My second argument is um, subtraction of number and then multiplication and finally division okay finally um, uh, we give a print statement um, um, 
and uh, paste our result with uh, this print statement so i'll write paste um, and then the printing statement um, will be the result is and i'll paste my result here so that's all so you see only few line of course are here and, and let's see uh, how we uh, we can um, uh, work this uh, this course as a calculator so let's print this statement first and then uh, start to prompt our choice okay enter your choice i'm gonna add uh, two numbers at first so my choice for addition will be one and then i'll prompt my first number okay enter your first number um 10 and then i prompt second number my second number is uh, 25 and then I run this result and print it okay uh, perfect so the sum of 10 and 25 is 35 of course and uh, let's try out um, some other operations and for that you have to go back and make your choice so enter your choice I'm gonna multiply this time so my choice is 3 now I'll prompt uh, my first number for that. I'll take decimal uh, number this time. So I'll take okay, 20.5 and I'll prompt the second number. So it is five, okay, just the integer. And let's run our result and print it. Okay, the product of 20.5 in 5 is 102.5. Um, so, yeah, this is the way to run our calculator in our studio. Now, you can try as much as you like, and even you can try this course in your R studio and um, see whether that works fine with you or not. Uh, well, uh, that's all for today. Uh, thank you very much for watching this video and um, if you like this video don't forget to like and subscribe my channel thank you